What up guys, I'm David Fisher. Come check out our shop. So we got all three of our SEMA builds for this year. All these trucks went out at the show. As you can see, they're all matching, have the same wrap, they all have the same design. And then now they're just put to work, like this dually, tow pig, I mean it tows trucks, tows trailers, goes to the races, it goes all across the country. This is my new 2020. As you can see, my daily wheels right now, we're running 4WP S-Series wheels. This is a new wheel that came out for four-wheel parts. Of course, rigid light bars. I mean, you can pick those up in any four-wheel parts. Nothing but the brightest. And obviously this one, you know the pink isn't for me, but how cool is that? With the Razor deck on the back, all line x out, that thing, it's a head turner. I think any guy wishes they had her truck. Got a bunch of my old race bikes, an old Suzuki 250 back there, my dad's old 450. Basically storing a bunch of our show wheels too. We got two sets of 28s, American Forces. Got one on 42s and the other wraps in 40s. So we had these on the trucks for SEMA. They definitely change the look of the ride, for sure. Here's one of my bikes I convert from summer to winter. Winter, I mean a timber sled kit. So the ski and track on the back. Um, it's called a timber sled. But yeah, this is my 450 race bike. I mean, I put it to dirt for this summer, but I've been so busy, I haven't even rode it. You can see, it. look at the tires, they're still, this bike's never even seen dirt. Uh, next to it, you see here is an Alta, fully electric dirt bike. Got some other plans for it for the, for the winter. Some fun for the snow and electric, like, I don't know, some, something a little different. Do some fun. Um, a few things in there, but you can go in the back and check out what's going on upstairs. So up here, it's kind of just our personal shop. All of my snowmobile race stuff sitting up here. Uh, it's kind of cool. We got uh, one new project right now. It's a 2021 Chaos, and it's already getting built for the water. Um, as you see, when I said water, yeah, we race snowmobiles on the water. You can tell they're pretty different compared to your normal snowmobile. As you can see, this one being completely stock. The first thing a lot of people notice, the skis. Look at how much shorter the skis are. And the front ends are narrowed up for turning because you counter steer and lean the sled over and just have it right on its side through the corners in the water. And the biggest thing with these, you gotta seal them up. These are belt driven. Once that belt gets wet, bottom of the lake you go. So this one was gonna get turned into a stock sled for the pro stock class. Brand new 2021, hasn't even seen snow, but it's gonna see water first. So, so far, season's been really well, been doing really well, even though kind of all the crap going on right now, we're still able to get out and race, and um, I'm able to do something that most guys aren't, which is racing in the summer, as well as in the winter. I get to spend my whole life on a summer. So we got my 850 Mod Chaos. So by Mod, I mean, you full motor build. I mean, it's got all the trick parts in it, all the go fast goodies. But yeah, as you see, like I have my short little mini skis from CNA Pro, the custom spindles from Zollinger Racing Products, from the Fox shocks, air floats, every little thing. We got custom made fuel tanks, quite a few little things that make this thing work. So one cool spot we got in the shop, we got the dyno. From building custom maps to our razors, or putting our dirt bikes on the dyno and building a map for the winter for our timber sled kits. Even the snowmobile track dyno. You know, you can build different clutching setups and do everything with the clutching. So on the track, I mean, that's, that's how you gain your most horsepower when you can test in the shop and in the field. You can do it all in here. Got a full dyno cell. Kind of cool, we can flip the switch and simulate 50 mile an hour winds in here. And especially on those hot days, just find myself hiding out in this thing. So coming to the back of the shop right now, we got, we got Pleasant's race car right here. As you can tell, all pink, also known 404 Barbie. He's been racing the pro stock class this year and we're uh, having a good time out there with these razors. This is gonna be a pro mod car they're putting together right now. 
You can see these Pro Armor harnesses that you can purchase at fourwheelparts.com. I mean, there's a bunch of different things. Four Wheel Parts isn't just for trucks and Jeeps. You can also get lots of different Razor products. One of the things we always do at the shop, the Camp Chef is always on. I need to get some tall dad socks and maybe some jean shorts, maybe cargo shorts with pockets. This would be mint. To have the total grilling attire. I mean, we're always constantly working in the shop late at night. Have a late, late snack. Everybody loves that.